There is a great responsibility for every person, for every individual to share the godly blessing that he feels from within. The Maker, in the same way that he made our faces different than each other, also our wisdom, our knowledge, our senses, and all of our inner spiritual structure is different. And like that your smile will affect another person in a positive way and will give him the encouragement and the joy and happiness, exactly the same joy and happiness that he needs by your smile. Also your advice and your emotional support sharing your wisdom from your own life experience will do the same thing for him. And we must count on ourselves and believe in ourselves to realize that that is our main goal and main mission for us to be strong in that, that we will understand, comprehend, go with it all the way that we have been blessed by the Maker to carry a godly soul within us and that that is our mission to go and shine that light out to the world. And we need to believe in ourselves. And this is the foundation of our faith in the Maker, that we should believe that He believes in us that He has a great faith in us. And this is why we're saying in the morning, I'm thanking you, Hashem. Modani lefanecha, melechai vekayam, a king that is live and exists. Shechazarta binishmati, that you brought back my soul to me, into me, bechemla, with compassion. Rabbi Munatecha, your faith is great. Which faith? The Creator has faith in us. And that's the reason why He woke us up this morning, because He believed that we have a chance, that we can make a change, that we are able to spread light. The light is shining upon us from heaven, from above. And there are many, many layers of scrolls of Torah that all the letters, like the letters in the holy tablets, that they were carved and there was a space for each letter in the shape of the letter in the tablet itself, in the stone. In a similar way, there are scrolls on scrolls of books of Torah that are spread from heaven till this world of making Olam Ha'asiya. And the light of infinity is shining through those carved letters and the bright light is shining through the upper layer to the bottom, through all the middle layers. And when it shines down to our world, it's after going through all the layers of that so-called prism glass of crystal tablet like that the tablet was built out of the sapphire stone so those scrolls are also of a clear material that the creator himself made and the light is shining through the holy letters and creating combinations in endless amounts. There is no end to the amounts of combinations that are coming down to this world from the world that is above. And the end reflection is the outcome that we see in this world. And we are here now on earth in this lifetime enjoying an endless amount of light, 
that is shining through the holy letters of the Torah scrolls and our souls are an inner spring, an inner channel that can communicate and spread out tons of light, massive amounts of wisdom if we are channeling it properly. If we are nullifying ourselves to the divine will of our Maker and we do the best that we can with our time, that we are spending it with Hashem in faith, thinking about Him, talking with Him, consulting with Him, asking Him for all our needs, for all our requests, and also for atonement, for honest confessions to Hashem, telling Him the truth from the bottom of our hearts, in our words, in our language, saying the truth, being truthful, speaking simple, honest words from the heart, and by that, increasing the amount of light that will shine through and from our inner spring of wisdom that is the channel of our soul out to all of our surroundings for them to enjoy the wisdom that we have been blessed with. That's where we began this wonderful teaching tonight. And with that conclusion, you should go out to your lives to spread the light among your loved ones and to know that the Maker is with you, supporting you, and wishing you complete success, spreading His message out to your surroundings and all your loved ones to be blessed. May Hashem answer all our prayers and requests in no time. Amen. Can you hear that song?